All right, I don't know if the video is shut down or not, but that was a thousand pound test rope that I used for magnet fishing, and it snapped pretty easy. That thing is standing up just dead on straight, and once it releases, I have no idea which way it's going to go. the video is shut down or not but that was a thousand pound test rope that I used for magnet fishing and it snapped pretty easy. That thing is standing up just dead on straight and once it releases I have no idea which way it's going to go. Yeah, I don't mind running like a fool to get away from that. On the ground, all safe now. All right, I just wanted to show you what happened with that one. I'd say I screwed up, but you know what? There was no way to not screw this one up. As you can see inside this tree, it was all rotted. It rotted right from through the middle there. There was nothing there. So I tried cutting off this way 
so that I could try to come over here because the tree really wanted to come this way. I was trying to get it to go that way. I can't sun you up there because the sun's right there. But as I was cutting it, it just started falling apart. And you can see all the, yeah, it just, it just came apart. And I'd hack a little bit at the back to get that back strap to go. And it still wasn't going. Even taking this back strap out and having this cut and this cut, it still wasn't going with this, only this and this holding it. So I had to start cutting into those to try to get those to go out. But you can see, uh, you can see, but it's, it's, this thing's rotted right out. It just wanted to go the way it was going to go. But the scary part was it just got caught, caught in that tree right there. And that last cut, I don't know if you saw it, when that when the, uh, the rope broke. I don't know if the battery died just a moment before then, of course, but it took out the, uh, the tripod on the camera. I'm hoping that got in there. It broke the tripod, so I might as well get at least a decent video out of it. But it's down, and that was one I was worried about, and it's a lot more rotted than I thought it was, so I'm glad I got that down because I don't know where the house or the workshop or anything is going to go, and having that rotted thing sitting there, a good storm comes along, and it's going to take something out. I had to get rid of this one. I certainly didn't like the way it ended up coming backwards this way. And yeah, when that happens, throw the chainsaw and run like heck. There is no... <laughs> yeah, retreat is the best option right there. But, I was... Yeah, I'm still cutting trees down. The OCD is getting to me and I just gotta... I just can't stand it. I just gotta keep cutting trees. I got five more. Five more trees and I'm getting a lot of firewood out of it. So what the heck. Alright, see you later.